What's up everyone, Jake Berlin here with Apocalypse Movies and I am here today to review the very first trailer for American Assassin. That's right, the trailer for American Assassin had just been released. I have yet to watch it. I'm going to do a live reaction and review right here on the video. Before we get to that, um, let's do a little bit of backstory on American Assassin. Uh, the movie is based and adapted on the books by Vince Flynn. Um, the film stars Dylan O'Brien and Michael Keaton. Um, here's a little bit of a synopsis for the movie. Um, so Dylan O'Brien plays Mitch Rapp, a CIA black ops recruit, and the movie will follow Rapp's early rise as a CIA black ops recruit. Working under the instruction of a Cold War veteran played by Michael Keaton, Rapp is tasked with investigating apparently random attacks on both military and civilian targets, targets which lead them on a trail of a mysterious operative played by Taylor Kitsch, whose intention is to start World War III. Um, so very interesting, um, kind of sounds like the stuff we heard before, uh, but the books are very, very popular, and it's got some major players involved who, who make this movie even more exciting. Dylan O'Brien, Michael Keaton, obviously, and Taylor Kitsch playing as a bad guy, which sounds very cool. Um, so I'm very excited. Um, let's jump right into it. Let's do a uh, live trailer reaction right here. I'm gonna press play, and here we go. So, what do you remember about your parents' death? Car crash. I was 14. You started having discipline problems. Kicked out of three boarding schools after that. Let's talk about that day on the beach. Katrina, I love you so much. Will you marry me? What happened? You gave up everything after that, didn't you, Mitch? Ooh. Nice beard. No, not everything. What'd you think? You were gonna kill Mansoor and wipe out his whole cell. For starters, yeah. I like your agenda. Nice. I know exactly what to do with you. Dylan O'Brien looks awesome. What do I need to know about this guy? He's a warrior. Best I've ever known. There he is. Some bad things happened to you. Now you want to kill those mean old terrorists. You think that qualifies you for my selection process? My guess is if you and I go hand to hand, you can probably figure out inside of 20 seconds whether or not I have what it takes to make it through selection process. So, what do you say? Slice a man's throat right here like this. Well, in the movies. What is it you think we do here? We kill people who need to be killed. How dare you, a ghost? You don't exist. He's ready, Stan. He's not ready. First reactions, I dig it. It looks awesome. Um, some really, really cool stuff in there. Uh, we've seen the you know CIA operative kind of stuff before, but this is very different. Um, the teaser trailer does a really, really good job of kind of introducing us to this character of Mitch Rapp, uh, what he's been through. Dylan O'Brien, man, I got to, I'm gonna start off with him, but uh, I'm gonna watch her of Teen Wolf. I've, I've watched Teen Wolf for from the beginning, uh, just concluded this past year. Um, I always knew that he was gonna be some kind of star. Uh, he's obviously doing the Maze Runner movies. Um, not the best movies, you know, don't make a ton of money, but uh, he succeeds in them for sure. He was in last year's Deepwater Horizon, which I thought was just phenomenal. And I thought he was a really, really good part in that. Um, so to see him kind of get his own franchise now in this kind of role, I'm totally in. Um, I'm excited to see what he brings to the table. He looks totally badass with the beard. Um, he looks like he's handling the guns really, really well. Um, so I'm looking forward to that for sure in his part. And then obviously Michael Keaton. Uh, this guy's been on the rise the past couple years and ever since his role in, yes, Need for Speed wasn't the best, um, but I enjoyed it for what it was. And, and I thought um, Michael Keaton did a really, really good job in that kind of fun role. And then obviously Birdman, 
uh, last year in The Founder, and all these different kind of roles. He's an upcoming Spider-Man Homecoming as a villain. Um, so to see him in this kind of role uh, is very exciting, um, especially with uh, someone like Dylan O'Brien working under his wing. wing. And then you have Taylor Kitsch uh, as the villain, which I'm looking forward to the most because we haven't seen him as that yet. We've seen him as the hero, seen him as the good guy, kind of the bad boy. But uh, I'm looking forward to him as the villain, which is very exciting. So um, all signs are a go for American Assassin right now, man. I think it looks awesome. Uh, in, a, in a world of comic book movies and, and big, giant budget uh, superhero flicks, uh, this kind of grounded, real-life stuff is what I look forward to on a daily basis. And so to get this in the, in the middle of all these giant movies coming out in the, past, in the next couple months um, is very exciting. So uh, two thumbs up for, for American Assassin right now. It looks awesome. First trailer totally killed it. And I can't wait to see more. So um, head down to the comments. Let me know what you think of the American Assassin trailer. Did you like it? Did you not like it? Uh, do you like who's involved in it? Uh, what do you think could be better? Are you, a, are you a reader of the books? Do you think it looks like it adapted the book pretty well? Um, so let me know. Give us a like, share, subscribe. We really appreciate it. And uh, until next time. See you later.